Hello, I'm Fast Lawyer. Today we're doing a full live review for Dynamic Shooting VR, a game that was released on the Steam Store today, February 14th, 2024, Valentine's Day in the USA. It normally retails for $10. It's on a release sale 15% off. I received a free Steam key through the Steam Creator Connect program, and I'm testing it out on the MetaQuest 3 using Link Cable. Now, I did say a full action live review. So, I've already beaten the game. It took me about eight minutes to, to beat the game. Let's go ahead and let's start. Let's just play. Um, a game would have Grab to be... Your gun. A game would have to be very good for me to recommend it for $10 if I can beat it in eight minutes. Holster your gun. Are you ready? I'm afraid... Stand by. Action. No, this is not a this is not a bad game. But it's also not It's also not really good enough. Not at the list of price anyway. And it's also also kind of out there were 2017 VR games that were basically better than the shooting gallery and I, I would say this game is a shooting gallery which you know there's nothing wrong with shooting galleries I like shooting galleries um, but this one is more on the arcade side you know it doesn't have that realistic physics you know if you want realistic physics I think the best gun simulator still to this day is Hot dogs, horseshoes, and hand grenades, or H3 VR. I, I, I still think to this day it's still the best sandbox gun simulator shooting gallery game out there. Now, I do wish there was more like a single player campaign with it, you know, versus just the open. Because I know not everybody's going to like the open. But you know what? I'm talking about H3 VR. Let's just play this game. Like I said, it takes about eight minutes. It took me about eight minutes to beat it. Now, last Grab time your I. Gun. Last Holster time I used gun. this, Holster your, are you ready? But I'm gonna Stand use the by. the rifle this time. Action! I don't know. Is there is there one more? Is there? Oh, I missed that one, and it took extra time. Now, as, as you guys can tell, I'm not really aiming down sights. I'm, I'm really hip firing. Uh, but, you know, like I said, this is pure arcade. It doesn't have the best visuals. It doesn't have the best sounds. And it def definitely doesn't have the, the best gun mechanics. Um, like I said, and, and the UI and everything, everything here is just outdated. You know, there were 2017 VR games that were that were better than this. And just the lack of content, you know. Like I said, I beat the game in about eight minutes. Grab your gun. Are you ready? Stand These holsters by. are also very outdated, Action. man. I'm terrible with the left hand. I'm just terrible with the left hand.
I don't think I'm hitting anything with my left hand. <laughs> So again, like I said, I mean, it, it's fine. I mean, it's not the worst game I've ever played, but it's also not the best game I've ever played. And we're near, we're nearly done. Like I said, there's Grab just not, gun. there's not Are much to this ready? game. Stand by. Even the voice is kind of generic. Action. I don't know what the point of these high scores are. Uh, like, I can't even tell if I did better than my last run or not. So, you know, I don't think there's much replayability here, honestly. Because uh, I, I can't tell whether I did better my last time Grab or not. Holster your gun. Are you We're ready? nearly done with this game. As you can Stand see, there... By. Action. Even with this type of game, you know, most games have, like, a good guy, bad guy, you know. Uh, shoot them. Don't shoot here. You just shoot it all the time. It doesn't matter. You see a target. And the guns just really don't have any kind of weight. Or, you know, it just feels too hard. Which again, I know some people like that. And like I said, we're we're nearly done with the game. And uh, no, actually, we are done with the game. That's it. There's no coming soon. We we finished the game. <laughs> so this is dynamic shooting VR. Uh, like I said, normal price ten dollars, fifteen percent off, really sell. But to me, this is more like a ninety nine cents game at best. At best, honestly, it feels more like a like it should be a free demo. Um, it says more coming soon. This, they would need to, uh, I don't know, 20 times the content to make it worth $10. Because, I mean, right now there's just not enough content. Uh, the content maybe is worth $0.99 cents if you're going to put a price on it. But like I said, I finished it in 8 minutes and there's just not much replayability. The gun mechanics are outdated. This is... Uh, there were games in 2017 in VR that were better shooting galleries in this game. Um, the graphics were, or again, not not. I'm not gonna say they were bad, but they weren't good either. You know, I, I would say they're, uh, they, the graphics were okay. Maybe for 2017 VR, these graphics would have been okay. Maybe, but even then, I think there were better looking games in 2017 VR. And like I said, the, the holsters look ugly. The UI is ugly. Um, there's just too little content. So. If I have to rate this game, I think I would give it a 3.5 out of 10. Just, there's just no value here. There, there's no reason to recommend this. Uh, you know, it's Valentine's Day. I wanted to, you know, do a, do a positive review for you guys. Give you, a, you know, show a game some love. But instead, I'm doing the opposite. Uh, and, well, it's been a pretty bad Valentine's Day for me personally. So I guess this fits with valentine's day so yeah this is not a good game i mean again i don't think it's bad i don't think it's a terrible game but i just don't think it's good enough and you know i, I think it's subpar and i just think there were better uh, vr shooting galleries back in 2017 it's not 2024 and this just doesn't cut it anymore this is just it's not good i can't recommend this game to me this should be a free demo and if it was a free demo, I could recommend the download for those just looking for like you know, a mindless shooting gallery. Um, there should be like a leaderboard or some way to tell that you know you're doing better this time than the last time. Um, I, I don't know how you would notice that from from playing this game. 
Uh, yeah, maybe you have to manually write it down somewhere. I, I don't know how you would tell that you're doing better or not. But anyways, I'm Fast Lawyer. This has been my full <laughs> gameplay live review for Dynamic Shooting VR. Like I said, I received a free Steam key, but as you guys know, just because I get a free Steam key doesn't mean anything to me. You know, I'm gonna rate the game fairly. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna go into games with open minds, not looking to give a negative review. But if they're not good, I'm just gonna I'm gonna tell you the truth. It's not good, and this is not good. So, anyways, I'm Fast Lawyer. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you found it useful. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, have a wonderful day. Goodbye.